This is the um, second video explaining the electroscope uh, demo. Now we're using a positive object. Again, you have uh, these diagrams on a on a handout, and you kind of want to fill them out as we're going through this video. All right. So if you recall from the demonstration uh, that we did in class, or the video that you actually watched to get caught up. Um, we used a positively charged rod and touched it to a neutral electroscope. All right. So what we want to do is uh, add electrons here. And looks like we got some problems with some of those electrons. We'll get rid of that and put the, the good ones on there. So we've got to put on an equal number of electrons as we have positive charges to show a neutral um, Electroscope and the fact that the leads are hanging straight down here uh, indicates that it is neutral. And so, what we want to do uh, is actually uh, show what happens using an arrow here uh, what happens with these electrons when the positively charged rod touches the electroscope. So, I'm going to grab a, a writing device here and then open up the full screen again. And so you, remember, electrons are negatively charged. The rod is positively charged. Opposites attract. And so what will happen is electrons will actually move to the, to the rod. OK, let me get out of this screen here and go back to my, back to my drawing tool. Or not to my drawing tool, my, just my get away from the drawing tool. And so you want, what you want to show is that the electrons that are on the uh, neutral electroscope now are going to move, OK? They're wanna, going to want to move on oh, my arrow. Let's bring that forward, shall we? And bring to front, OK? So we want to show that it's move. These guys here, again, want to bring that to front. Uh, let's see here, order, bring to front. So some electrons now are going to move. Another one, got to bring to front. Are going to move along this arrow to the, to the rod. So basically all these guys are going to move upwards, okay, towards the, towards the rod as you see there, okay? So this kind of explains what's happening before or just before we see the electroscope leaves spread apart. Now over on the right side, we want to show after. And you'll notice that, well, we've got some electrons that have been transferred um, to the rod, okay? And so what is left here on the electroscope are just, you know, just a few of the electrons that were there beforehand. And so now we have an electroscope that has one, two, three, four, five electrons and more positive charges than those electrons. So the overall charge of the uh, electroscope now is positive. That makes the leaves positively charged, okay? And therefore they're going to repel and spread apart like you see there in the diagram, okay? So what's happening? Electrons are being transferred to the rod because Negatively charged electrons are, are attracted to the positive rod. Opposites attract. Um, and then when you bring the rod away, those electrons stay with the rod. And then the uh, electroscope is left with a deficiency of electrons. In other words, less electrons than they had before. And the overall charge of the electroscope is positive. Okay.